<sighs> oh my god. Is this an elevator? Someone's using the elevator. That's weird. Wonder who's in the elevator. Is it the king? Maybe he's about to pass to the city and he's all like, I'm checking around as I'm just at his castle. That would be kind of funny. Oh. Where's that elevator go to? I'm sure I've probably gone and bought some food before this because I know the king, since everyone talked about it. Oh, what the hell? This looks like the ruins, but faded oh my god it is the runes basically the way is blocked by two padlocks there's a note howdy i'm in the garden if you have anything you need to get off your chest please don't hesitate to come the keys are in the kitchen and the hallway well i just look around i guess it's a golden flower i do like golden flowers like if anyone had seen the hardcore series a long time ago they would have known seems like gardening tools there's a photo album, scrapbooks, books on how to make tea. Ooh, Shadow Man will probably like that one. Oh, God! A long time ago, a human fell into the ruins. Injured by its fall, the human called out for help. Oh! I'm being told a story. It's a trash can. It's full of crumpled up recipes for butterscotch pie. Oh, there's one of the keys. The stovetop is very clean. Someone must use fire magic instead. Ah. There is some white fool stuck in the drain. Right fur stuck in the drain. The fridge is full of unopened containers of snails. Oh, no. Azrael, the king's son, heard the human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. So someone, well, I mean, I was at the first. There's obviously six before me. Oh, there's a heart-shaped locket inside. I'll take that. And what's on this? A worn dagger. I really don't want to take this, but... Why is there two beds in here? It's a family photograph. Everyone is smiling. There's lots of striped shirts in here. Mm. Dusty toys. A lot of flowers. Rooms under reservations. Oh! Over time, Azrael and the human became like siblings. The king and queen treated the human child as their own. The underground was full of hope. Another key. Despite everything, it's still me. Yep. It's Asgore's journal. Oh, the current page says it's a nice day today. The ink is still almost wet. Ah, oh, okay. He was just here. Maybe he was in the elevator. Maybe I was right. Oh, there's a Santa Claus outfit inside. Eh. Yeah. There's clothes in there, like normal. It's a trophy. Number one nose nuzzler. Well, I got the keys. There we go. There's an old calendar from the end of 21... 2001X, a date is circled on it. Time for the basement. Oh, then, one day, the human became very ill. The sick human had only one request, to see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we can do. Then, the next day, the next day, 
the human died. Azrael, wrecked with grief, absorbed the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. With the human soul, Azrael crossed through the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset, back to the village of the humans. Azrael reached the center of the village. There, he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Azrael holding the human's body. They thought that he had killed the child. The humans attacked him with everything they had. He was struck with blow after blow. Azrael had the power to destroy them all. But, Azrael did not fight back. Clutching the human, Azrael smiled and walked away. Wounded, Azrael stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. The kingdom fell into despair. The king and queen had lost two children in one night. The humans had once again taken everything from us. The king decided it was time to end our suffering. Every human who falls down here must die. With enough souls, we can shatter the barrier forever. It's not long now. King Asgore will let us go, will give us hope, will save us all. You should be smiling, too. Aren't you excited? Aren't you happy? You're going to be free. Well, this is the hallway. I'm guessing the next room is the ca uh, the king's castle. What? So you finally made it. The end of your journey is at hand. In a few moments, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then, now. You will be judge. 
you will be judged for your every action. You will be judged for every EXP you've earned. What's EXP? It's an acronym. It stands for Execution Points. A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, your EXP increases. When you have enough EXP, your love increases. Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for Level of Violence. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. The more you kill, the easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you will hurt. The more easier you can bring yourself to hurt others. But you, you never gained any love. Of course, that doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive. Just that you kept a certain tenderness in your heart. No matter the struggles or hardships you faced, you strive to do the right thing. You refuse to hurt anyone. Even when you ran away, you did it with a smile. You never gained love, but you gained love. Does that make sense? Maybe not. Now, you're about to face the greatest challenge of your entire journey. Your actions here will determine the face of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Asgore will take your soul and destroy humanity. But if you kill Asgore and go home, monsters will remain trapped underground. What will you do? Well, if I were you, I would have thrown in the towel by now. You didn't get this far by giving up, did you? That's right. You have something called determination. So as long as you hold on, so as long as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. Alright. We're all counting on you, kid. Good luck. Like that, he's gone. I'll never understand Sans. Oh, this is hard. I'm trying to think of the right choice. Throne room. What's down here? Is just a, is this just another exit? It goes down deep. Oh, wow. A lot of coffins. It's a coffin. There's a name engraved in it. Kara. It's empty. Oh, that's kind of creepy. Why is it empty? Well, alright. I should probably have gone back by now and gotten food, but... What the hell? <sighs> oh, it's pretty too. Dum de dum. Oh, is someone there? Just a moment. I have almost finished watering these flowers. Here we are. Howdy. How can I... Uh oh. Uh 
I so badly want to say, would you like a cup of tea? But, you know how it is. Nice day today, huh? Birds are singing, flowers are blooming. Perfect weather for a game of catch. You know what we must do. When you are ready, come into the next room. Ah, oh, this is hard. I'm guessing this is the queen's throne. How tense. Just think of it like... A visit to the dentist. Visit to the dentist. Dentist. Huh. Man, my throat's getting closed up. Are you ready? If you are not, I understand. I am not ready either. This is the end. <sighs> and when I step through these doors, there's probably not going back, unless I'm dead. I really don't want to go. Holy fuck, this is weird. This is the barrier? This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped underground. If... If by chance you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. I see. This is it, then. Ready? Oh, that's heavy. A strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems my journey is finally over. I'm filled with determination! Human. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. As Gore attacks, I don't need to check you. I know you're strong, and I gotta put myself together. Let the best man win. Oh my god! Ouch! I'm already gonna die! Oh no! Ouch! Jesus Christ! Okay, yeah, you're gonna probably win. You are called the king for a reason. What? Uh... Oh! Just survive that. Oh, he is that magic? That's where it comes from? What is this? Oh, wow. Oh, no. That's actually not hard to dodge. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. I'm still in the game. What is this? Oh my god! Woohoo! 
I'm so sorry. Ouch. Ouch. Gotta eat this pie finally. Oh, this again. Oh, thank God. This is a lot simpler. But other than that, no more food. Oh, God, this is stressful. Oh, no, not this. I suck at this. Woo! Ouch, 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 ouch. Oh, my God. Oh. I'm still in the game, baby! Oh god, this is gonna hurt! Oh my- Jesus Christ! Oh my god, come down! Oh! Move, 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 move. Ouch! Come on, that barely touched me. That grazed my hairs. Oh my! Oh! I shouldn't be this happy. Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, I hate this one. Oh man, I'm actually gonna die. Oh! Oh, man. Ooh. Yeah, come on. Play with me. Play me with those memory games. I'm good at them. Oh, my God. That was too fast. Ouch, I ran into that one. Oh, come on! If I remember from the last time I died, when I ate the pie, he got weaker. Ouch. Take this! Oh. So that is how it is. I remember the day after my son died. The entire underground was devoted of hope. The future had once again been taken from us by the humans. In a fit of anger, I declare war. I said that I would destroy any human that came here. I will use their souls to become godlike. and free us from this terrible prison. 
Then, I would destroy humanity. And let monsters rule the surface in peace. Soon, the people's hopes return. My wife, however, became disgusted with my actions. She left this place, never to be seen again. Truthfully, I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. I just wanted everyone to have hope. But... I cannot take this any longer. I just want to see my wife. I just want to see my child. Please, young one. This war has gone on long enough. You have the power. Take my soul and leave this cursed place. When she start talking like your kid like that, it makes me feel bad if I do that. I mean, I don't want to kill you. After everything I have done to hurt you, you would rather stay down here and suffer than live happily on the surface? Human, I promise you, for as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you as best we can. We can sit in the living room telling stories, eating butterscotch pie, We could be like, like a family. What is happening? No! Oh, oh even his soul. You idiot! You have earned a thing! This world, it's kill or be killed. Where am I? Oh my god. Did he do what I think he did? I'm just in the void. The only time I've been in the void was during that one time where I got that one ending. My head's not correct right now. Oh, Jesus Christ! Howdy! It's me, Flowey! Flowey the flower! I owe you a huge thanks! You really did a number on the old fool. Without you, I never could have gone past him. But now, with your help, he's dead! And I've got the human souls! I've been empty for so long. It feels 
great to have its soul inside me again. Hmm, I can feel them wiggling. Aw, you're feeling left out, aren't you? Well, that's just perfect. After all, I only have six souls. I still need one more before I become God. And then, with my newfound powers, monsters, humans, everyone, I'll show them all the real meaning of this world. Oh, and forget about taking your old save file. Save file? It's gone forever. But don't worry. Your old friend Flowey has worked out a replacement for you. I'll save over your own death. So you can let me tear you to bloody pieces. Over and over and over! What? Do you really think you can stop me? <laughs> you really are an idiot! Oh, jeez, this is not gonna be an easy fight. I may be an idiot! But I'm an idiot that tries. What has he turned into? I am terrified. I mean... You and probably someone else is probably the evilest people I've met. Oh, hi. Oh! Oh! What the fuck? Ah! Oh! Ouch! Take that! Oh, this is unfair! Oh my god, this is chaos! Oh! Warning! Oh god, those eyes though! What? Oh, why knives? Oh god, somebody please help me! Oh! I've been saved! Oh no, I'm caught back in here! Oh my Jesus Christ! What the- What is that thing? Oh my- Ouch, 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 ouch! What is this? Oh my god! Another warning! <laughs> oh no. Please, somebody help me! Shattery man, anyone? God! I'm literally gonna fight against God! I didn't get all that! Oh! What? You can't pull this! He's literally saving over me! How oh, did I survive that? Another warning. I am literally in cuts and bruises. Oh no. Ouch, 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 ouch. Oh, somebody please save me. I'm about to get stepped on. Oh. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, I didn't get to grab all that. There's like a soft spot in there. Oh no. 
Oh, I hate the fire. I hate being third degree burns. Oh, not the fingers. Not the fingers. Oh my god, this is absolute chaos. How am I surviving this? I am like ultra instinct up in here. Oh, so this is something Shattering Men probably like. This one's probably the easiest ones by far. Can somebody please help me? Jesus. I, every time I've been screaming, that's been helping. I need... That one was probably the worst at healing me. Oh, no. This is unfair! You're literally damaging me! Oh, another warning. Dark green. I don't remember that. Oh, no. Oh, no. I hate this. Why fire? Why is it always fire with these people? <laughs> Please, somebody help me. I God, I hate this. Ouch. <gasps> oh, food. Oh, I'm at full again. No, not the moves, not the moves, not the moves, not the moves, not the moves. Not the mouths. Take those! What is this? Not the bees! I'm a literally about to die. What? Oh, I don't like how there's a gun pointing at me. Ooh. Somebody, somebody! Help! Get full wait what the human souls are helping me this is fantastic i'm not even one of you guys i just have a soul i mean i guess it's a human soul but i mean same turf right thank you oh is this maybe i can have power finally ouch that still hurts Oh, thank you! The human souls are healing me! Take this! Human souls are gonna have to do a little bit of that healing me if you want me to survive this. Because he still hits hard. Or maybe I should just get better at dodging. My god, this is getting faster! My... How am I supposed to dodge half of this? Not the noobs! Take this! Gotcha, baby! No! 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 This can't be happening! You! You! Oh, what? This is unfair.
Ouch. Did you really think you could defeat me? I am the god of this world. And you? You're hopeless! Hopeless and alone. Golly, that's right! You're worthless friends! Can't save you now. Go for them, I dare you! Cry into the darkness! Mommy, Daddy, somebody help! See what good it does you! Can somebody help me? <laughs> but nobody came. Boy, what a shame! Nobody else is going to see you die! Excuse me? What? How'd you? Well, I'll just... What? Where are my powers? Oh... The souls? What are you doing? No! Oh, no! God. You can't do that! You're supposed to obey me! There you are, beaten and withered down. I'm pretty sure since you didn't have a soul to begin with, you couldn't control them because, I mean, it's just only it's only the scientific guess I can give because I don't know why. I don't even think humans can do that unless I don't know. I could kill you right now. How many lives I could have saved? After you killed the king, probably my only escape if I was going to kill him. But I'll be no better than you if I kill you. What are you doing? Do you really think I've learned anything from this? No. Scaring you won't change anything. You think I care? I'll kill you. I mean, I've been killed before. You're not, and plus, a lot of people want my head. I'll kill everyone. I'll kill everyone you love.
Hey! Is anyone there? Well, just calling to say... You made a snowman really happy. Guess I should say something else, too. So, it's been a while. The queen returned, and is now ruling over the underground. She instated a new policy. All humans who fall here will be treated not as enemies, but as friends. It's probably for the best, anyway. The human souls the king gathered seem to have disappeared. So, uh, that plan ain't happening anytime soon. But even though people are heartbroken over the king, and things are looking grim for our freedom, the queen is trying her best not to let us give up hope. So, uh, hey. If we're not giving up down here, don't give up wherever you are, okay? Who knows how long it will take. But we will get out of here. Sans, who are you talking to? Oh, nobody. What? Nobody? Can I talk to them too? Here, knock yourself out. Wait a second. I recognize this number. Attention, human. I, the Great Papyrus, am now the captain of the Royal Guard. It's everything I've ever dreamed of. Except, instead of fighting, we just want our flowers. So that's ever so slightly different. And we're hoping Dr. Alsis with her research. She's going to find a way to get us out of here. Undyne is helping her too. Though, to be honest, her method of helping... ...seems kind of... ...explosion... ...included. But I think Elphys likes having her around. Uh-oh! Hey! Where are you up to, punk? Nah! Please don't noogie the phone! Hey, who's in charge here? Me! Oh, yeah, that's right. I quit my job as the leader of the Royal Guard. Actually, since we won't be fighting anymore, the World Guard totally disbanded. There's, uh, only one member now. But he's extremely good. Yeah, he is. Come here. Please don't noogie the skeleton. Anyways, now I'm working as Alpheus's lab assistant. We're gonna find a way out of this dump once and for all. Oh. Yeah, and I'm a gym teacher at the Queen's new school. Do you know I can bench press seven children? Awesome, right? Hey, I'm sorry about what happened with Asgore. You were just doing what you had to do. It's not your fault, he... Ah, darn it. I miss the big guy. Come on, Undyne. Snap out of it! Uh, I guess I'll tell you her office is doing. Well, she's the same as ever. Maybe she's a little more reclusive than normal. Seems like something's really bothering her. But she can get through it. 
I'm there supporting her. That's what friends are for, right? Hey, whatever you are, I hope it's better than here. It took a lot of sacrifice for you to get there. So, wherever you are, you have to try to be happy, okay? For our sakes. We'll feel better knowing our trouble was worth it. We're all with you. Everyone is. Even the Queen. Hey, wait a second! Doriel, Doriel! Do you wanna... Heh, <laughs> she says she's busy. But if she knew who we were talking to... We wouldn't get the phone back for at least a few hours. We have the mercy to spare you from her. But call back any time, okay? She'll love to talk. Oh, whoops. This thing's almost out of battery. So, hate to cut this short, but... Be seeing you, okay, buddy? Bye-bye for now. See ya, punk! Thank you. 